It's Anne from Anne Ellis Angels, and I'm here with your card reading for the coming week. These are general readings, so take from them everything that resonates with you, leave behind anything else. Most importantly, enjoy the reading and have a really positive week. I will be using my teacup tarot deck, so let's get right on with your reading. The reading for Virgo. And your overall energy here is card 15, Ego. Now, this card is a mindfulness card, and it reminds you to leave behind anything that's weighing you down or holding you back. And our lovely angel here, look, she's leaving behind these heavy rocks, which represent fear, stress, doubt, self-sabotage. And she's moving forward totally focusing on positivity, optimism and confidence. She's left behind these heavy rocks and now she's picked up the balloons which are so much lighter and she's focusing on these positive qualities and these are guiding her along her path. So stay positive and confident, have self-belief, yes you can and leave any old habits of thought or old doubts and fears behind you. Our help or our hurdle, the Six of Pencils says it's time to move on and time to feel good. Our lovely angel, look here, she's got a suitcase. It can mean going on holiday sometimes. She's decided she's making that move. She's on her way. She's decided she's on her way and she's feeling good. Our guidance, the Ace of Teacups comes in. Now the Aces are all about new beginnings and the Ace of Teacups brings along new positive emotions, love, sometimes it can be a new home, positivity, happiness, joy, a strengthening intuition. These are new beginnings here for you and these lovely new positive emotions are here for you. Look at them fluttering in from the tree into the teacup there. New beginnings, new happiness here for you. How can we help ourselves? The nine of coins reminds you to take some time out, to rest, relax, enjoy some little luxuries. Just treat yourself. Look at the angel here. She's having a lovely bubble bath and a cup of tea at the same time. She's enjoying those little luxuries. She's taking that time out just for herself to rest and rebalance. Pulling it all together, the 16 life experience card tells us it's time to make positive changes now. And our lovely angel here, look, she's built a sandcastle, but that's washing away now. But she's taking from it all the wisdom, all the pearls of wisdom, all the knowledge, all the experience, and she's moving on to new things and she's making those positive life changes now, which will help her taking all this lovely wisdom along with her. So time for positive changes now for you. And the Three of Pencils card says, it's time to move on. We were talking about that here. There's been a time of rest and relaxation, a time of healing. Now that's over. This card says, trust that things are getting better. Trust that things are moving on and be ready to make those steps in that new positive direction. That's just what the angel here is doing. She's stepping out in a new direction with positivity and confidence. So just to clarify, the two of life reminds you to keep life in balance, make wise choices, and it also reminds you to have some fun, take some time out just to relax. The 12 of wisdom card says, celebrate your individuality. Be a lovely individual you 
and look at things with a new perspective, get a new look at things and look at things in a positive new light that will really help you move forward. The one of life card says new doors are going to be opening for you, new doors, new opportunities are coming in, the abundance is coming in for you. So get ready to move towards it. This is right here, it's not far away. And the 20 of wisdom card reminds you to pause and reflect on just how far you've come, just how well you're doing, and to start to climb to wonderful new heights. This goes hand in hand with this life experience card. Take that time out to reflect and then make those positive changes and start to plan your new adventure to climb even higher. And the zero of wisdom card, the first in the deck says, time to follow your dreams. Yes, you can do it. Enjoy these new opportunities coming in. Don't let any fears hold you back. It may mean stepping out of your comfort zone. Don't let those fears hold you back. Know you can do it and make those new steps forward. And the final outcome card, the three of wisdom says, time to get busy, time to take action, start these new projects, work on these new ideas. Get your sleeves rolled up and take those action steps because this opportunity is here for you. This lovely new adventure is here for you. You just have to let go of the fear step out of your comfort zone and get busy. So I hope you've enjoyed the reading. If you have, click that subscribe button, make the bell ring, then you'll get notified when I do the next one for you. So take care now and I'll see you soon.